and welcome to the ViewGuard installation series. I'm Brittany, your host and ViewGuard product specialist. In today's installation primer, I'll be demonstrating how to install the following ViewGuard product. If you need help installing another ViewGuard product, please check the other videos in our series. ViewGuard currently has four different products to meet your needs. First, the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Frameless Privacy Filter, which offers unrivaled privacy protection for your computer while reducing glare and protecting the screen from scratches. Individuals within the viewing area can see the screen clearly, but individuals outside the viewing area or at an angle will not be able to see the information displayed. ViewGuard Anti-Glare Frameless Privacy Filters are easily detached and removed. Second, the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Matte Screen Protector, which reduces glare and harmful ultraviolet rays while protecting your display from scratches. The Anti-Glare Matte Finish is excellent for high gloss displays and reduces glare and reflections in both artificial and natural lighting. Third, the ViewGuard Crystal Clear High Gloss Screen Protector, which protects your screen against scratches, ultraviolet exposure, and is almost 100% transparent while still simulating that chic, glossy finish that's popular today. Fourth, the ViewGuard Anti-Glare TV Filter, which reduces glare while protecting your TV from scratches. The durable, hard plastic material makes this product your best choice to reduce glare and reflections and protect your TV from damage. Today I'm going to demonstrate the installation process for the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter. For demonstration purposes, I will use the Apple MacBook Pro. The correct ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter for this computer is a 15.4 inch widescreen 16 to 10 aspect ratio version to fit this MacBook Pro's display. ViewGuard manufactures the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter for a range of laptops and monitors. And if you don't know the size you need for your device model, please feel free to contact us at ViewGuard.com for a recommendation. Step 1. Clean your display in order to remove any dust, debris, or fingerprints. Use the ViewGuard alcohol-free anti-static LCD clean wipe to clean your entire display, as I've already done here. Finish by using ViewGuard's microfiber cleaning cloth, which is provided with your purchase. Use this to pick up any remaining pieces of dust or debris. Step two, hold the ViewGuard anti-glare privacy filter over the screen to ensure proper size and fit before installation. Step three, select your preferred finish, anti-glare matte or ultra high gloss. One side of the ViewGuard anti-glare privacy filter has an anti-glare matte coating, which reduces glare and reflections. The reverse side has an ultra high gloss finish, which simulates the finish of popular high gloss displays. Step four, select the preferred attachment type from the two available options provided in the accessory pack. Attachment option number one is a set of self-adhesive transparent holding tabs which attach to the frame of the display and allows you to insert the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter between the holding tabs and the screen. Attachment option number two is a set of residue-free adhesive squares which attach directly to the four corners of the display and secure the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter directly to the screen. If you prefer the self-adhesive transparent holding tabs, Remove the two holding tabs and place them on the lower corners of the display. For much larger screens, you may require the extra holding tabs to apply at the bottom. After selecting your preferred side, just slide the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter right into place. If you prefer the residue-free adhesive squares, attach the adhesive square in each corner of the display. Remove the plastic coverings. And gently press the ViewGuard Anti-Glare Privacy Filter directly into place. Now, you are ready to work on your display concealed by ViewGuard technology. Please visit our website if you have further questions or for installation instructions. 